Welcome back to Dark Souls, everyone, and today is the, oh, probably the, the best episode ever. We get to face the strongest creature in the whole, uh, the whole Dark Soul. All of it. The guy that's been behind it all. We get to fight the, the best boss in the game. But where could this best boss in the game be? Well, he's closer than you might think. He's actually right here, down under Firelink Shrine. So, like always, we have to go down. So, uh, yeah, let's let's go down. And down we go. Let's go down quickly to avoid the very uh, deadly skeleton enemies. Oh, how spooky they are. Yes, very, very worrisome they can be. Oh, but, oh, this boss. A masterpiece of a boss. Uh... Just game design at its finest, I would have to say. Um, From Software really outdid themselves with uh, just where this boss is and just its move set and just the lore behind it. All all fantastic uh, things of this boss. Yeah, Fan fantastic work they did. We'll just uh, light this bonfire. Ooh, bonfire lit, and we'll just uh, push this lever. And uh, I think I hear my, my doorbell ringing. I'll be right back after you know one second. All right, that didn't even take a second. Let's uh, let's get on with it. Uh, yeah. So now that this door is open because we pulled that lever, we can go through the this bit. Oh, and the this bit is the best bit. Uh, yep, you get the rolling skeleton there, and these skeletons uh, have a... Uh, they increase their ability to roll as we progress through the level. Don't you worry. So we're just gonna... Uh, excuse me. Uh, yep, you can uh, go away. So if you kill the, those little, uh, little guys with the torches, they're the necromancers, or... Uh, something or other pyromancers or fire dancers something like that they uh, keep reviving the skeletons and if you uh, kill them then the skeletons don't revive you want to be careful with those skulls they'll knock you off and they won't care about it too they're happy to do it so we'll just uh, push this lever this time instead of pulling and uh, continue to avoid enemies as we do, as it is the proper way to play this game. Yep. Yep, very good. Yep, very good. I'll just, uh, you know, have a little heal. Why not, you know, treat yourself? You kill another one of these boys. Sometimes they drop their lanterns. And that's how you juke some skeletons like that. Now, I'm pretty sure it's this way. You just do a little like a uh, hop, skip, and a jump down here. You just stroll right down the stairs. You know, can't say no to killing a necromancer. Don't bother on that lever. You know, only evil people pull that lever. And uh, yeah, you just uh, you just walk down here. You have a little sip of your uh, little bit of orange juice right there, a little bit of Estus right there. You get down here. You can pick up this little green titanite shard. You know, for whatever reason. For some reason that didn't count as a plunging attack on that guy, you know, fall down this, get a nice little cutscene of one of the best characters in the game. <sighs> Who is it gonna be? Does his name start with V and end with Amos? Oh, look at that, it's Vamos the Skeleton. Smith. Look at him, man. You know, real men grow bones for their beard hair. That's how you know he's a real man. Look at that, hear that voice. Alright, Vamos. I don't, I don't want to bother you too much. I'll, I'll leave you to it. Oh, vamos. Like, if you want fire weapons, he's the guy to visit. Yep, so uh, let's uh, sprint through this area as fast as we can because the enemies in this area are uh, demons. Oop, 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 oop. That's pretty bad. Pretty strong voice. Okay, and we're good. We've made it. Hopefully. Ah, oh, alright. Looks like the boss would be right in here. 
We're just gonna have a sip. We're we're gonna need our um our best our best stuff for um uh yep, nah forget it, we're probably fine. Alright, let's go. Oh oh shit. The strongest boss in the game, the best cutscene in the game. You know they say two heads are better than one, which why this, this that's probably why this boss is so strong. Because uh, not only does he have two heads, he's got three. And uh, yeah, that's pretty good. He also has books, and like you all know, uh, books are knowledge, and knowledge is power. And so this guy's got the most of that. So there he is, debating with himself, you know, talking, having a little conversation. And then uh, realizing that I am just not in the right place. And that's the boss, everyone. That's Pinwheel, the uh, the strongest boss in the game. Maybe he'll uh, give us uh, something uh, interesting. Uh, yep, a mask of the father, strongest mask in the game. Well, that has been it for uh, this episode. Look at here, it's a skeleton. Uh, this one's not alive this time. Well, you know, uh, yeah, best best one ever, strongest man in Laudran. Well, I'll see you guys later. Like the video if it was good. Don't if it wasn't. See ya.